How much grain will your village give? Whatever you say, Your Excellency. Look at my hands. Look. See the calluses? These are not the hands of an Excellency, but of a farmer. So we speak peasant to peasant. How much can you give? Forty bushels. There'd be more, sir, but our lads, the Temerians, that is, took from us earlier and... You will give thirty, and that will do. Let us settle on it, and I wish to see the transport soon. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you kindly. I summoned only the Elderman and the Smith, Willis. But it is said he is a dwarf. You are too tall to be him. To another video of the Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. And this Kita, come here. You want to say hi? Come on. From the two of us, we both say hi. She's just very kissy. All right, girl. Thank you. All right. So, without further ado, let's get back into the game, shall we? So, I believe the last time we left off, we were to go look for some Once more, there are four factions. For what? Faction T. Oh. Done drinking. Then fuck off! <laughs> Don't want your kind here. Better round up someone else to help. Three of you don't stand a chance against me. Well, I could fuck you up by myself. If I had a bag over my head and my hands tied behind... Actually, no, not even then. Chet, Lesh, back off. I'll teach this vagrant a lesson. Man on freak. Your ass is mine. Nice meeting you. Okay. They wanted some, so I guess I got to bring the thunder and like. Winds howling. All right. The plea. Let's try and find some. Uh... Oh, let's try and find. Uh... I guess I can't really upgrade until I actually get. Uh, schematics. Okay, here. We need a lot of uh, ingredients. Potions and whatnot.
unless it was shaped as possible. Would be nice. Have a little. This area here. Just look for resources while we're trying to find an area. It's not a tree here. I'd ever really eat dog, mainly because I have dog and can imagine eating her. That would just kind of disturb me.
and 35. What does this one do? Better. Hunting. Polycons. and get as much as we could possibly get. Well, I'm not actually getting Looking for a woman. Uh, like everyone. Not like everyone. And not just any woman. Mine smells of lilac and gooseberries, dresses in black and white. Two schnapsies. <laughs> It'll lift your spirits. Finding her, that'll lift my spirits. You look haggard. It's just a few drops to improve your mood. A little schnapsies never hurt a soul. Can we cut to the chase? You seen her or not? Yennefer of Wengerberg. Never mentioned her name? Yet you described her perfectly. And once I hear something, I never forget. Can't help it. How do you know Yennefer? What a question. Master Dandelion's ballads, of course. The only way a humble merchant might hope to rub up against greatness. Unless, that is, he's as lucky as I am. And runs into a very patient witcher. Into Geralt of Rivia himself. The Butcher of Blaviken. Recognize me from Master Dandelion's ballads, too? 
to your health. What do you do? Who are you? A mangy vagrant. Gone to Rodim, at your service. Vagrant? That a profession now? Ah, once a merchant of mirrors. The madding crowd dubbed me Master Mirror, or the Man of Glass. You seen Yennefer? Deepest apologies, but I must ask. Is this about love? Sure, why not? Guessed it. It's love. I knew it at once. What do you know? Tell me. Before you appeared, it never occurred to me that might have been Yennefer. Who would have thought? Get to the point. An Ilf Guardian scout from the local garrison saw her. Where? At their camp. She rode in there. Dark of night. Black and white. Gooseberries and... Yes, I know. Had a terse exchange with the garrison commander and raced off. Where to? <laughs> I'm not omniscient. Ask at the garrison. Thanks. We men of the road must stick together. Perhaps one day I'll be in trouble and you'll be nearby to help. There we go. Got a little bit more information. The Nilf Gardens. There's the door right over here. Get on a roach. Let's go find ourselves Yennefer. of power. Whoa there, Roach. Oh, I got a hold B. Go. And this is
this thing. I guess I can't get in there. Well then. Get that while we're here. Her. Whoa. Come on, Roach. Come on now. This mountain here. Let's check out what these nook guardians are holding. You know what? I'm not gonna say no to uh to uh well items. I have my eye on you, Lord Link. Oh, I got the uh, point up. Let us Or, or uh, more damage to fast attacks. Here, let's get up to this uh, guard, shall we? Right. Uh, Military camp. No locals allowed without the express consent of the garrison commander. I look like a local to you. You look like trouble. Dead wrong. I make trouble go away. I'm a witcher. A witcher? Captain Peter Sugwin Levy is in the tower. Turn right, past the gate. Huh. You black ones aren't so scary after all. Can even be nice if you want to. Don't get accustomed, Nordling. To the tower. Go. Stop! Poor dark and... Oh. Two hits and I'm dead. <laughs> Remind me not to steal from these guys. Ah, soldiers are men too, and so they must eat, correct? I eat some Step away. 
password. Don't know any. So, out for a little walk here, eh? Counting the Emperor's swords to lull you to sleep? Well, in the army, we've a place for nosy ramblers. The scaffold. And thick skulled quartermasters. They got a place. <laughs> uh, you're clearly skilled at banter. And haggling? You got a knack for that as well. Show me what you're peddling. Let's see. That. 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 Let's see. Um. Well, I mm, don't have enough of that. Show me what you're peddling. Crafting. Let's see. What can we craft? A whole nothing. All right. Right there. Aye. So long. How much grain will your village give? Whatever you say, Your Excellency. Look at my hands. Look. See the calluses? These are not the hands of an Excellency, but of a farmer. So we speak, peasant to peasant. How much can you give? Forty bushels. There'd be more, sir, but our lads, the Temerians, that is, took from us earlier and... You will give thirty, and that will do. Let us settle on it, and I wish to see the transport soon. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you kindly. I summoned only the Elderman and the Smith, Willis. But it is said he is a dwarf. You are too tall to be him. Very perceptive of you. Geralt of Rivia, Witcher. Vatgarn. This explains why I did not hear your footsteps. What do you seek here? Yennefer of Vengerberg. Where was she headed? That is a military secret. Haven't thrown me out yet. Haven't called the guards. So go ahead. What's your price? There is a griffin in the area. Slay it, and then I shall see what I can do. Why do you care about this griffin? Because I care about people. The beast has killed ten already, including a few of my men. To hunt it, I would need to mobilize the entire garrison, comb the woods, organize a batu. Simply impossible. Too big a hassle? No too high a risk. I cannot disperse my forces. Temeria's army we have crushed, but its common folk remain, ready to answer a call to arms. So, as to this griffin, I can sit on my hands, or hire a professional. It's a deal. Some questions before I start. Know where the griffin has its lair? 
It kept to the Vulpine Woods at first. I sent a patrol there, five young men. A hunter found them two days on. They only recognized them because they wore our plate. Since then, the griffin has grown bold. Attacks in villages, fields, on the main road. Meaning it's abandoned its lair. Gonna have to set a trap. I judge from your tone this will not be easy. What do you require? Need more information about this griffin, its sex, why it's abandoned its lair. Shall I bring you witnesses? They won't say anything I don't already know. I need to go where your men died, look around. What's the name of the hunter who found them? Mizlov. He has a hut south of the village, very near the wood. Helpful fellow. A little strange, though. I'll need bait. A specific herb. Buckthorn. Scent should lure the griffin from ten miles off. Buck... Buckthorn? I do not know this. But I am not yet fluent in the common tongue. Mm-hmm. Probably mastered the basics, though. Hands up. Kill them. No. First came idioms. Don't play with fire, for example. Go to Tomira, an herbalist. She lives near the crossroads. She will aid you. Tomira and Mislav. Thanks. Es sun diakten. And there we go. Thank you all for joining me. Next episode, we will end up going towards fighting the griffin. Thank you all for joining me, and I hope you have a wonderful morning, night, afternoon, whatever uh, time it is where you're from on this beautiful blue marble floating in space. Y'all have a good one now. Have a good one.